Oh, ho, ho. hello there. I have a book for you today called Christmas in the Mouth's House. Now, this is a particular book that some of the different pages pop up and also not only do they pop out, but some of them of the pictures it, like on the doors and the windows and stuff, they actually pull open so you can see what's inside. And in this house, we're going to read about, well, we'll just begin and then we'll, I'll tell you some of the details in, the, in this house. It's Christmas Eve in the house, mouse house, and everyone is getting ready for the big day, but no one can find the star ornaments for the Christmas tree. I guess we won't need a Christmas tree this year, says Papa, unless someone finds the ornaments, of course. Papa and Mama have secretly hidden 12 star ornaments throughout the house for the children to find. Now, if you ever get this book or you um, borrow it from a library, then you can go through this book and there are areas where you can open the pages. And this one, actually, this is a door that leads to another room. But sometimes you'll find places, little places that open up. And inside you might find one of the Christmas tree ornaments, which are all gold stars. So, we are going on our quest throughout the house to find the golden ornaments. I won't find every one for you. I'll save some for you to find yourself. Grace decides to see if Grandma can help. Grandma, she says, Papa says we won't have a Christmas tree if we can't find the ornaments. Well, you should keep looking then, Grandma says, but in my day we made our own. How, Grace asks, but Grandma is already fast asleep. And you can see Grandma, she's already sleeping next to the warm fireplace. And in this picture, we have a window that opens up. And in it, I'll help you, says Jack. He's outside, ready to help to find or make ornaments. And the door opens to the other room on this page. And there's also another little chest down below here, which I'll let you open on your own. Grace and her brother Jack search the kitchen while Mama is busy preparing the Christmas feast. Why don't you look in the cupboards, Mama suggests. And here we are, they're in the kitchen. Mama's cooking and the cupboards are over here. And you can see you can open them up and you might find a mouse in one of the cupboards or maybe a gold star in ornament in another cupboard. As soon as dinner is finished, the children look under the bed, in the wardrobe under the cushions, and inside the drawers. Soon they have found lots of things to decorate the tree with, and even more of the lost stars. And here they are in the bedroom. And you can see the, where they keep the clothing, the wardrobe chest. It opens up too, and then you find a mouse in there. Plus, I think there's someplace else that opens to find a star. Before they go to sleep, Grace and Jack sneak into the nursery to see if they can find anything else for the tree. They tiptoe into the bathroom while Nanny is putting the baby to bed. These toys would make perfect ornaments, Jack whispers. Then they scurry off with their pockets full. And here they are in the baby's room. And you can see here, we have a doors that open and there's cupboards that open. Oh, and I'll tell you, there's one of the gold star ornaments in this cupboard. Oh, oh. When the children wake up on Christmas morning, they peer out the window excitedly. The ground is covered with snow. Papa, Mama, they shout. Come and look. That fir tree would make a perfect Christmas tree, says Papa. If only we had found our Christmas star, says Mama. And now they have this room in here. They'll find a gold star under one of these little areas, but under other ones, there's little birds hidden in the snow. We did, the children shout, and we even made our ornaments too, own ornaments. They show their parents all of the decorations they gathered. How lovely, Mama says. Papa brings in the tree from outside and the whole family decorates it together. Perfect, he says, and everyone agrees that it's the most beautiful Christmas tree that they had ever seen. And now you can see all the old gold ornaments and all the things that they found throughout the house to put on their own Christmas tree. 
What a lovely little story that was. See you next time. Bye-bye. Oh, 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 oh.